Okay, so today we have a pretty spicy video for you guys today. Gonna be pretty much no filter just because there is a lot of drama going on with Epic 7 and the company Smilegate that you know publishes Epic 7, right? And if you look on the subreddit or if you've been on their Discord or have been on their website at all, you're gonna see there's a lot of talk about something that seems very irrelevant to the game, uh, but it is relevant. We'll talk about that in a bit, and that's gonna be Taiwan and also China. So basically you're gonna see there's a lot of posts wherever you go about Epic 7 uh, talking about China and Taiwan. For example here if you look at this post in the center here, I know it's hard to see but if I click it you'll see uh, take back the CN take back the CN server compensation or give the rest of your player base the same rewards. You really messed up this time Smalgate and that's kind of talking about how the Chinese server got a huge huge like a massive compensation and if you actually see what the compensation is for it's even more annoying and you're gonna see there's so many uh, other posts about it don't let smile get away with this you know day one player here chinese or the cn situation disheartened me you know i support taiwan and you're gonna see there is just a ton of stuff right um and you're gonna see here the compensation includes 5k bookmarks and a limited 5 star selector. So you can choose a limited unit of your choice, which is pretty crazy. And people are talking about getting a truck, you know, just more drama. And you're going to see here if we actually look at this post, which I have pulled up. Um, it's a translation from Chinese, so I don't really know how accurate it is, but should be pretty obvious about what it is. So basically, Smile gets apologizing here for the incident on Thursday, whatever that is. Uh, which I do know what it is, and they're going to be compensating all the players 5,000 Skystones here and a 5-star limited summon hero selection ticket. So that is pretty insane. They're apologizing so much and people are like, oh, well, what did they do that actually messed that up? And I don't know exactly where the post was on the subreddit, but so I actually found the post here. Uh, it's not for me, it's from the subreddit, of course. This guy kind of explained it for us. And you're going to see that they're talking about some discount for the App Store or Google Play Games where you can get a discount for your purchases. And the reason why this happened, it's going to sound really stupid, <laughs> because it is, is that Taiwan in the red box here at the bottom is listed under a nation. And with the current government situation in China and Taiwan, I'm not really too... Uh, up to date with it but basically from my knowledge is that you know china doesn't recognize taiwan as a separate country they believe that they are the same country and then there's a lot of drama and politics about that which i don't want to get too much into but you know a lot of people would disagree with that statement me included and say that taiwan is a free country but that's for a different topic i don't really want to talk about politics too much here you can disagree with me if you want but basically that's the situation and they got really mad about it <laughs> just because Taiwan was listed under as a nation here. So what actually ended up happening is they made this post. They said sorry, basically, um, to the Chinese players when when they were mad about Ch Taiwan being listed as a nation. And then people are saying, oh, does Epic 7 and Smilegate, a Korea, Korean-based company, actually not recognize Taiwan as a country then? Um, so it makes a lot of drama. I think it's really, really stupid. I don't even know why they're giving this compensation. Um, yeah, I mean, like, they could say sorry. Even that's pretty, like, messed up about it because you're kind of just throwing Taiwan under the bus and the people that support Taiwan under the bus. But giving this compensation is just ridiculous because what about us, right? Like, <laughs> what? Do we have to just, you know, say that we don't think that a different country is a country and then, you know, we compensation too? Like, as a global player, as someone... That's from America. Do I say, oh, I don't recognize Europe as a um, continent or a region. And because I we are mad about it, you have to give me compensation. Like, it makes no sense. Like, if they're going to do this, um, yeah, they should probably give it to everyone, <laughs> you know? Because this just looks very bad. It looks like they're just literally catering to the Chinese server. And I think they're doing this because they definitely make the most money from the Chinese server. And they have... I think China server is like the most recent one, so yeah, this is what is happening. Um, pretty stupid, right? So I'm not really sure what you guys think about it. Let me know in the comments down below you know, if you disagree with me and thinking that this is really, really dumb and that 
they shouldn't have done this at all and because they did it now they're pretty screwed they have to compensate all of us uh, let me know in the comments down below but you know it's a pretty bold statement from epic 7 and smilegate as a whole to kind of retract their statement that taiwan is a nation and then compensate them for making that mistake right that's a pretty fucking bold statement to make so yeah i'm just curious what you guys think and let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the situation because I think it's fucking ridiculous, and I don't know why they did this, and because they did it, you know, I kind of lost some respect for them, and hopefully we get compensated too, because if, you know, they don't compensate us equally, it looks super, super bad on their part, but yeah. Thank you for watching, guys. I don't really make too many videos on drama, but it's fun, so why not, and I will see you guys next time.